NAVSENT and the Office of Naval Intelligence assesses with high confidence that the limpet mines used against the motor vessel Kokuka Courageous were of Iranian origin and design. Based on the exploitation and our understanding of technical characteristics of worldwide limpet mines. Furthermore, the attack was almost certainly conducted by the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps Navy, based on historical Iranian press video and IRGCN training with the same class of limpet mine, as well as IRGCN vessels removing the unexploded mine after the attack. As you can clearly see from the video, an IRGC Navy boat approached the motor vessel Kuku Courageous and removed the limpet mine that had remained. When the NAVSENT exploitation team, augmented by Navy Explosive Ordnance Disposal Technicians, arrived on scene, they observed the imprint remaining behind from the limpet mine that the Iranians had removed. At that imprint site were multiple nail holes and a magnet that remained. As you can see on the first slide, the blast hole is consistent with an explosive charge detonating on the skin of the ship. The small circular hole on the bottom right is part of the ship and not a result of the damage. An explosion is a rapid chemical reaction that results in the release of high amounts of energy in the form of pressure and heat. As that energy transmits onto and into the hull, you can see inward rolling of the hull itself at the blast hole. Also at the blast hole, as well as on the weather decks of mo motor vessel Kuku Courageous, the investigation team was able to recover fragmentation that resulted from the detonation of the limpet mine. These pieces of fragmentation were aluminum, which were recovered from both the blast hole and the weather decks. These pieces of fragmentation are composite materials recovered from the weather decks of motor vessel Kokuka Courageous. A NAVSENT investigation team, augmented by Navy EOD, rapidly deployed in response to the attack. The investigation and exploitation team conducted a reconnaissance of the vessel noting the imprint left behind by the limpet mine the IRGCN had removed. They also noted two nail holes at this imprint along with this magnet. This magnet required significant effort to physically remove it from the hull. As you can see, aluminum from the limpet that the IRGCN removed remained attached to the magnet. This aluminum is of the same metallurgical content as the aluminum fragmentation collected from the blast hole caused by the first limpet mine.